Does TikTok have more power over our minds than we think? It's a question worth pondering as we delve into the mesmerizing world of this video sharing platform. TikTok has become more than just an app on our smartphones. It's a phenomenon, a cultural wave that swept across the globe, pulling in users of all ages from all walks of life. But what is it about TikTok that makes it so incredibly addictive? The short snappy videos, the trending music and dance challenges, or perhaps the promise of viral fame, Whatever the reason, this app has a firm grip on society, influencing our habits, our thoughts, and even our behaviors. And as we spend more time scrolling, watching, liking, and sharing, we have to wonder, are we falling into a kind of mass psychosis? Is TikTok subtly reshaping our realities? With its 1 billion users worldwide, TikTok's influence is undeniable. Let's delve into the story of Jane Doe, a teenager whose lifestyle was massively influenced by TikTok. Much like others her age, Jane was captivated by the trendy bite-sized content that the app offered. Initially it appeared as harmless entertainment, a simple way to pass the time. However, Jane's curiosity soon transformed into an addiction. She invested countless hours scrolling through TikTok at all times of the day. Her world started revolving around her smartphone screen, increasingly disconnecting her from reality. Her academic performance declined, friendships dissipated, and overall health was sidelined. The once lively teenager became a mere reflection of her past self, reclusive, tense and progressively detached. But that's not where Jane's story concludes. TikTok's algorithm, engineered to retain users, led Jane on a wild goose chase. The more time she spent on the app, the more it began to understand her, tailoring its content to her interests. It began with harmless content, dance trends, comedic sketches and adorable pet videos. Then it took a darker turn. Jane found herself encountering increasingly distressing content. Conspiracy theories, violent visuals and radical ideologies began to dominate her feed. The once entertaining algorithm turned into a puppeteer, fueling her with negativity and fear. Parents noticed the transformation but felt powerless against the unseen force controlling their daughter. They observed Jane's mental condition deteriorating, her perception distorted by the content she was immersed in. Even after seeking professional help, the harm was irreversible. Jane was ensnared by a digital Jane's experience is not an isolated one, it's a peek into the darker side of TikTok. It's a warning tale revealing the app's real-life effects on its users, especially vulnerable young minds who are its primary target. It serves as a stark reminder of potential hazards hidden beneath the surface of seemingly harmless social platforms. What makes TikTok so addictive? The answer lies in its algorithm. Let's dive into the world of sophisticated coding, artificial intelligence, and user behavior analysis that makes this platform so compelling. You see, TikTok's algorithm is a master of learning. It observes, records, and learns from every interaction you make on the platform. Whether you're scrolling, pausing, liking, or sharing, each action is a valuable piece of information that the algorithm uses to shape your TikTok experience. Imagine you're on a virtual shopping spree, only instead of clothes or gadgets, you're browsing through content. Every time you pause on a video, the algorithm makes a note. It's as if you've picked up an item, examined it, and considered buying it. The algorithm takes this as a hint of your preferences and starts to show you more of the same. This is where the concept of the echo chamber comes into play. The more you engage with a certain type of content, the more similar content you'll get. It's a cycle that feeds on itself creating a personalized world of videos that cater to your interests. But here's the catch. While it's great to see content you love, this also means that you're less likely to come across differing views or new perspectives. The algorithm's goal is to keep you scrolling, and it does that by feeding you what you already like. This echo chamber effect can lead to divisiveness and misinformation. When we're only exposed to one side of the story, our perception of reality can become skewed. We become more entrenched in our beliefs, less open to other perspectives and more susceptible to false information that aligns with our views. The TikTok algorithm doesn't have a moral compass. It doesn't distinguish between truth and falsehood, right and wrong. Its sole purpose is to keep you engaged, to keep you scrolling, to keep you within the confines of the app. The TikTok algorithm, a silent puppeteer, is pulling strings we may not even be aware of. Is TikTok influencing our self-esteem, body image and mental health? The evidence is compelling. Let's delve into the psychological of TikTok. It is essentially a platform where the content may significantly impact an individual's perception of self-worth and body image. 
It's not difficult to understand why this could have a profound effect on the global TikTok community. Consider the experiences of users such as Jane. Engrossed in a world of beauty trends, fitness challenges and viral dances, she found herself comparing her reality to the seemingly perfect lives of others, her self-esteem gradually decreasing. This was not just an isolated incident rather an indication of a broader pattern. People are getting drawn the culture of TikTok, their self-perception and mental health being influenced by the content they consume. The line between healthy digital consumption and excessive comparison is blurring, with users often finding it hard to strike a balance. This phenomenon is not just fascinating but also deeply concerning. TikTok's power to shape self-esteem, body image and mental health is a growing concern. It's time we took notice and addressed this issue head on. TikTok, a tool for entertainment or a catalyst for mass psychosis. As we draw to the close of our exploration, let's take a moment to reflect on the key points we've discussed. Firstly, we've seen how TikTok's addictive nature can grip its users, leading them to spend countless hours scrolling through the app. Then, we delved into the power of TikTok's algorithm, which essentially curates the content that keeps users engaged and glued to their screens. We've also talked about the concept of an echo chamber, where users are continuously served content that aligns with their viewpoints, potentially leading to a narrow perspective of the world. And finally, we ventured into the realm of mass psychosis, the idea that large groups of people can be led to believe or behave in a certain way through shared delusions or beliefs. In the digital age, it's crucial to understand the tools we're using, the TikToks of the world, and their potential impact on our minds and societies.